time. Hey guys, okay, so I wanted to show you this quick little face paint that I made for my son. I just did it right now. I just completed it. Come here. Um, we went ahead and used some Walmart face paint, put it on his arms. He wanted it to kind of look like, you know, blood, blood and stuff. And he has this Nerf thing that he got. He, he needs to add some bullets on here. Oh, this shirt we got from Walmart. It says Zombie Hunter. And it was like five bucks, I think. And I just did this on his face. So that's um, the zombie face paint that I found on Google. Which is very gruesome. So I just went ahead and shaded in with a green face paint. Added some yellow, some green, some black to it. And on this side he just wanted it like splattered and stuff. So that's what he looks like. So we're going to go ahead and go to some festivals right now. And... Have some fun. Well, there's like a, uh, the muertos because I'm a zombie. Oh, yeah. And then we're also going to go to Dia de los Muertos. So, yeah. Anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed it. Um, I'm going to go ahead and do a face paint for my daughter. So, these are some of the things that I'm using. I'm using these uh, Walmart face paints. And uh, the one I went ahead and used for him was this one. And I also used... Um, I also had like some black face paint. But I went ahead and used... Like this black eyeshadow to kind of um, shade the eyeliner part. So I used that. And then I went ahead and used this green eyeshadow. And this green eyeshadow to set the face paint so it doesn't move. Um, because if you just put face paint, he can rub on it and it'll just, you know, go away. But if you set it, um, it'll last all night. And then to give it a little bit of dimension, I added some of this yellow to kind of, you know, brighten it up. So that's what I went ahead and did for him. I'll go ahead and do another video to show you what I did for my daughter. Thanks for watching. Talk to you guys soon. Bye, guys.